Hi there, and thanks for being a member of the Nootropics Expert YouTube channel. One of the perks of being a member are the videos I make exclusively for you. No one else gets to see these videos. And I'm open to making videos on whatever you want. So if something comes to mind or you feel you need clarity on something that you would also think would help your fellow members, please leave a comment under this video. I'll keep an ongoing list of videos to make for you guys. So hopefully one new video every week. And a shout out to our Neurohacker 2.0 members, uh, Na and Raw Result and Llewellyn Franklin and Plush Kids 1058. Let me know if you want me to use your real names uh, in the future. Otherwise, I'll just stay with recognize you by your username. And please encourage your friends to join this channel. It helps a lot to keep this channel going. It really does. And as our community grows, we'll have more opportunities to share and learn from each other. So thank you again for being a member. Today's video is about how to choose the best turmeric or curcumin supplement. Which is better, turmeric or curcumin? Turmeric Curcumin, extra strength turmeric, liquid turmeric, turmeric with Mareva, high absorption curcumin, turmeric and black pepper, and the list goes on. So where do you even begin when shopping for the best turmeric or curcumin supplement? Which one works better and which one is just marketing hype? First, it helps to know what we mean by the terms turmeric and curcumin. Turmeric is a shrub native to or Southern Asia and is a member of the ginger family. The primary component in turmeric is a group of compounds called curcuminoids, of which curcumin constitutes up to 90% of total curcuminoid content and is the most studied. Also known as Indian saffron, turmeric has been used for millennia in traditional South Asian cuisine and is the basic ingredient in curcumin. A study published in the American Journal of Epidemiology documented the results of the mini mental state examination scores for three categories of regular curry consumption by 1,010 elderly Asian men and women. The research authors found that those who ate curry often or very often had significantly higher cognitive performance. I love curry. I lived at Antigua for nearly a decade and enjoyed a roti wrap containing curried chicken for lunch at least once a week prepared by Indian immigrant families from Trinidad who own the, some of the restaurants on the island. But if curry isn't your thing, you can still get the benefits with a turmeric or curcumin supplement taken two or three times a day. Curcumin is the main active component of turmeric. So most of the positive reviews and clinical studies come from using a curcumin supplement rather than turmeric. But turmeric also contains other important volatile oils, including AR tumorone, B tumorone, and A tumorone. Curcumin provides protection against Alzheimer's, major depression, epilepsy, and other neurological disorders. Scientists think that much of this protective action comes from curcumin's anti-inflammatory and antioxidant property. Curcumin also acts like an MAOI, which boosts dopamine and serotonin in your brain, even enhancing the effectiveness of popular antidepressants. But it does not affect norepinephrine, which means that you can avoid the irritability that you can be caused by some of these drugs. Researchers in India found that curcumin may be used as an effective and safe modality for treatment in patients with major depressive disorder. And scientists also found that stacking curcumin with piperine boosted the supplement's bioavailability by 2,000%. Curcumin is known to possess antimicrobial, anti-inflammatory, anti-hypertensive, anti-tumor, anti-cancer, anti-diabetic, anti-psoriasis, reduces blood clots, protects your liver, and it helps control cholesterol. There's a host of reasons to buy a curcumin supplement. But research shows that the volatile oil AR tumorone found in turmeric boosts stem cell growth in your brain by up to 80%. So a plain curcumin supplement may not be your best choice if you're concerned about brain cell repair and regeneration or neurogenesis. You have one more important consideration before deciding which turmeric or curcumin supplement to buy. Because the popularity of this nootropic has made it one of the top-selling supplements worldwide year after year. The problem is turmeric is typically sold in powder form. And telling the genuine from the fake just by looking at it is impossible. Once a supplement achieves such market status, it is more susceptible to mixing with and diluted by lower-cost botanical ingredients like starch, chalk powder, cassava, and synthetic dyes. In other words, you're getting ripped off because the curcumin or turmeric on the label is not what's actually in the capsule. 
So your safe best option is to choose a supplement from a reputable supplement company who use one of several turmeric extracts in their product and are willing to provide a certificate of analysis if you ask for it. See my full review of turmeric and scroll down to the section types of turmeric to buy to see the major patented forms of this supplement. I'll include a link below to my website so you can see this review. My favorite turmeric supplement and the one that I've been using three times a day for the last few years contains BCM95. BCM95 is a standardized extract of turmeric containing a curcumin essential oil complex of 86% curcuminoids and 7-9% essential oil. Now recall from earlier in this video that turmeric volatile oil, AR Tumorone, supports the regeneration of brain cells. I use this product from Health Through Nutrition, Curcumin as BCM95, which I'll provide a link to below this video. And I hope you enjoyed this and found it helpful. Thanks for being a member, and please share this channel with your friends and encourage them to join us as well. And we'll see you soon.